people, my people, I've got some news for you. The intellectual dead heart of Australia is not Alice Springs, okay? It's um, Canberra. It's where politicians go and do what politicians do. And if you follow Australian political scene or anything, um, you know that Barnaby Joyce is the brain dead centre of Australian politics. Having said that, I've got people who have been to the brain dead centre of Australian politics recently. I haven't for about 20 years. And they brought home a gift for me. It is the Parliamentary Librarian's Gin from Parliament House. It's only available in Parliament House. Okay, there is no sound of happiness. Screw it up. Bloody politicians, they can't get anything right. Can't even give me the sound of happiness. Now, I've already poured a little bit into this. I'll pour a little bit more because, well, one of my kids gave me a, um, a day where I feel like six of my age significance, okay? Shall not go in, shall not tell tales. So, the smell of happiness says that this is a dry gin. Barnaby should be dry, like this gin, Barnaby. So for all of those of you who are not Australians, you don't have the pleasure of living in my country, we've got this idiot politician called Barnaby Joyce, who has recently taken leave for personal matters after he was found shit-faced in a camper street. Surprise, surprise, the leader of the National Party in the Liberal National, yeah, National Party in Australia getting drunk. I mean, if you look up Barnaby Joyce, and trust me, a head like that is perfect for radio, and they should really stop screening parliamentary proceedings, because a head like that's likely to frighten little kitties. So anyway, Barnaby should be as dry as this gin. Yeah, there's just nothing happening on the nose, okay? So let's try the taste of happiness. Yeah, that is a very, very dry gin. It's more likely about the only workable thing in Canberra, because Lord knows our federal politicians do. Um, no. The person wishing me in the background was actually wishing my offspring good night, not me. I've got a little bit more work to be done. So this is the Parliamentary Librarian's Gin. It is literally only available from Parliament House store itself. They're not going to mail it to you. You have to get your ass to, to camera and or know someone who is in Canberra who will mail it to you. Uh, Henry's in Tasmania make it basically. So I've got a sneaking suspicion that if you were to hit McHenry's dry gin you'd more likely nail this. Given how distillers like to, well like I do, they like to blow the buck. So yeah, this is the dry Liberian's gin. I think there's another one, a Parliament House gin or something like that. My friends only brought me away one bottle. That face. Uh, basically, I'm going to include the link, but unless you actually get your little twitch up there, that's not a lot. Subscribe, like, share, there are things you can all do. Tell your friends.